this is Perry over at Stinger Lifts. We were getting ready to take this uh, lift to one of our lucky customers up in Shawnee. Um, this is uh, how we transport, and this is a, um, a reasonable way to haul these lifts instead of breaking them down. You'll have to have a trailer that goes in between the post. So you're just going to raise your lift up. You're going to let the ramps down onto the trailer. And then you're going to come and you're going to take the cable off of each post up here at the top. As you can see, we remove the cables from each corner. And then, with a helper, you're going to lift that post up and you're going to put a pin through uh, the hole where the caster kit goes in order to keep the post up. As you can see, I just tied my cables down to the uh, straps that are holding the ramps down. So, yeah, once you get that uh, um, the cables off and lift your post up, come back and secure your uh, your ramps down with a strap. Okay, it's really not difficult at all. As you can see, I've got straps. Each corner, each each post is tied up off the ground. Now, when you uh, when you raise your post up to um, uh, to put your pins in, you may have to push your lock handle down. Um, it's it's easy, much easier than uh, uh, than trying to uh, disassemble it. Now, your power unit, um, you can haul it like this, uh, or you can um, take it off and put it on the ramp. It'll make uh, raising the column up a lot easier. Anyway, uh, yeah, this is uh, just the way we're going to transport this lift today. So anyway, if you got any questions, call us here at Stinger. And... Uh, Anytime you are uh, looking for a good car lift, call Stinger by Axe, 800-854-4850, or visit us on the web at StingerList.com.